Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo, and welcome back to Ratchet & Clank, Future Tools of Destruction. We're back after almost a week-long hiatus um, from content in general. Uh, it's been two weeks since Ratchet & Clank, so I really want to get on with it. As the episode goes on, I'll talk to you about where I've been, and why you haven't been seeing regular episodes on the channel quite as often. Now, I have had live streams... So that counts. That that counts. We gotta count that. It's hard to do live streams and regular content at the same time. But without further delay, let's get on. I've been doing actually really great in other aspects of my life. I just haven't been able to make regular content for the channel other than the Call of Duty live streams, which some of you don't watch that, so you don't know that I've actually the channel has still been, you know, it's still making content. It's just not uploads it's live streams and sometimes it's live streams and not uploads you know what I mean um, is that where I am now or is that my that was the mission right to find Quark he's got something let's see if I have a cash prize really the Imperial Fight Festival is it still I thought that was I need to catch up I haven't I haven't played in a bit but, um, yeah, I, last week was pretty much, not that loud. Last week was pretty much just Call of Duty live streams. Um, there's four of those that I still need to get the thumbnails fixed for and fix the title, tags, and descriptions. Other than that, it's been fine. Um, I've been working constantly. The Bombax Assassin has returned. All units, comb the festival grounds. Okay, I thought I was supposed to meet Captain Quark here, right? Mission. Okay, so I looked it up and it does look like we need to return to the Fight Festival and find Quark. So I think I can just take this cab here. Yeah, return to the arena. Maybe I shouldn't have done that though, because there could be... There could be, you know, benefit to actually checking back in some of the areas that I hadn't been in in a while. What's with the lighting? Spacecraft to the Macasian Station in Sector 9. All civilian vessels are to evac immediately. Oh, I could have taken that. There's a lot of exploring I need to do off off camera. But right now I'm just trying to make content for the channel, so it's gonna be just straight to the point. Or as at or as to the point as I can make it. These videos don't get quite as many views, so I just wanna try to do as good as I can. What can we do you for? Ammo's full. How much of these do I have? 3, 3, 11. That's not bad. Complete. All of these are complete. This one's pretty much complete, right? What's it missing? Oh. I don't have enough. I mean, I might have enough for something, but I don't have time to search around. So I've done some of the arena modes, but I haven't... In the thick of battle, fighting immeasurable odds for... Okay, so it automatically started me right back up. So that must mean that this is part of like, the storyline, that I'm actually in the right place. Go back to using arena hazards again. I never did figure out what the best weapon against these guys is. Um, got him. Nice. Oh yeah, it upgraded. It makes little mini bombs now. Incontinence happens to the best of us, but with a new quirk suppository, you don't have to be embarrassed anymore. The thing suppository may cause incontinence. <laughs> I don't even know if I've taken damage yet. There we go. Now we're 
we're getting somewhere. Oh, I wasted that one. Tired of losing crop after crop of jelly meat thanks to phosphor mitin. Okay. Now we're getting station, somewhere. Try Grumble that's new and improved lawn ninjas. Protecting your garden with the... Quickness. Protecting Looks your like garden with the quickness. Long shot to hot shot. Okay, I seem to have a pretty... Uh, I see... Oh man. Whoa, a lucky shot I was just about to say, I Let's seem to have a pretty defensible next. position from here. Unfortunately not. How much damage did I take? Round five to five. Is that three minutes left, or it's counting down to three minutes and four seconds? Okay, so I'm uh, I do. I am on a time. You just can't seem to land a hit, folks. This guy must be more irritated than a one-legged droid in a butt-kicking contest. I do we like how it forces winner. you to keep moving. My calls, tell him I'm out of town. Okay, okay, so we won that one. Good, good. It's time for our next major contender oh, of the nice. evening. It's a giant, menacing, energy creature of some sort. I might not win this the first couple of tries. See him dance. I don't know what kind of strange witchcraft our challenger is invoking, but it sure makes me want a boogie. Whoa, that looks painful. I'd turn away if I weren't okay. already completely desensitized by hollow vid violence. Oh man, he's barely taking any damage at all. That's not good. Okay, uh, we're gonna need... Why do you taunt me, sir? We're gonna need some of our more powerful weapons. Oh, that is not one of our more powerful weapons. What kind weapons. of black magic voodoo does this guy wield? He controls the forces of nature! Uh, definitely one of these. Whoa, a lucky shot from Mustachio! Let's see what he does next! Whoa, hey! Undefeated warrior is okay. Uh, I remember this Sandra one. Really killed over a hundred Lombax defenders during the ancient Kragmite Crusade. <laughs> Good thing our challenger isn't a Lombax. <laughs> All my powerful weapons are on the second slot. Now I need to lure him over to that. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh, this thing's annoying. Hey, hey, hey! You're gonna put some eye out of those things! Ooh, I, okay, I flew right into him. This is tough. I did warn you, I might not beat it the first couple of tries. Um. Oh, no! Uh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna need ammo. Let's try him again. I'll cut to the part where I almost win. Alright, Chief. What can we do you for? Please have them avert their eyes. I think I saw some pelvic thrusting in there. There we go. Okay, maybe he's just really, really powerfully strong. Like, look at all this damage he's taking. I'm there, like, look at his health bar. It's barely moving. Do we think it's safe to say that my weapons just aren't strong enough right now? Wow, a lucky shot from Mustachio! Let's see what he does next! 
Oh, dang. Okay, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Hey, hey, hey! You're gonna put ah, some blast those things. things! See, they want me to use this mode, but that thing is garbage. I hate that mode. So freaking slow. I hate moving this slow. That is like my only complaint with this game. Now I gotta go out of this camera mode so I can jump. Thank God for a weapon upgrade. Jump. Oh god, too early. This is just a reminder. Streaking to the arena oh, is prohibited by law. I'm looking at you, crushed up. Okay. Oh. And Zerk. Mr. Zerdon is looking to kill you. Okay, okay, bad. I think we might get him this time. Okay, Nano Swarmer's out again. And Mr. Zerdon. And we're out. Do I have any... No more of that. Yeah, that'll work. Wait, no. I mean, what, what enemies is he going to attack? There are no other enemies to attack. We might have him. Let's get some ammo. Because it might drop us one of the things that we've been using the most against him. I think he's done. Fun fact. In order to stay environment friendly, these didn't... Okay. This guy. ...leaders were recycled for the parts of our second place gladiator. That was a waste. No! Come on now. Yes! <laughs> that guy's tough. All that just to get a hollow pirate disguise. Outstanding work, strangers I've never met. And now the fruits of your labor. One hollow pirate disguise, perfect for parties and undercover misadventures. And for the little guy, a copy of my new exercise book, Body by Quark. Now you two can have the calves of a champion. Did you call us here for a reason, or are you just trying to get us killed? Can it be both? <laughs> just kidding. Here, I found this in Tachyon's underwear drawer. I, I, I thought it was... I, I thought it might be a clue. There's a mosquito in this room and it's gonna It's time tick for another off. installment of the Polaris Compendium of Historical Importantness. In this chapter, we will explore the galactic awesomeness that is Iris. The largest supercomputer in Polaris history, this mysterious behemoth is said to have an IQ of 3 billion. That would mean 170 terachnoid sages or 3 billion holonet fanboys. Built by an unknown race eons ago, Iris once served as the ultimate search engine for the universe. Now it resides deep within pirate territory, sealed off from the public. Its only master, the duplicitous Captain Slag. This has been another depressing installment of the Polaris Compendium of Historical Importantness. Hmm. Maybe Iris knows where the Dimensionator is. Let's go. Take me with you. I can't do this undercover thing anymore. I'm not a superhero. I'm just a hero. How am I supposed to survive without some kind of endorsement deal, huh? Well, uh, okay, take it easy, big guy. Maybe you can be a superhero. You just need to stop being so self-absorbed and whiny. You're right. This is not the time for vanity. It's the time to show the universe how amazingly awesome I am. I'm sorry, Ratchet. I hope you never have to endure the pressure of saving an entire galaxy. Wish me luck. That's just great. Oh my goodness, how long have we been going? Uh, 15 minutes. We've got enough time for a couple of battles. If the lights don't flicker out on me. I've been adjusting them to try to compensate for the fact that the sun is literally coming up right now. Which I... Um, that's a bad time for me to be recording because with extra light streaming in, it messes up the balance of the lighting, which is why you get all that flickery. I, I, I don't, I don't get it. Now it's not doing, now it's doing, anyway, um, okay, I think we're good. I'm just not going to touch anything else. Anyway. 
uh, defeat hordes of gladiators without feeling the wrath of the Emperor's fiery glare. This match has been brought to you by Quark Caustic Chewable Vitamins. Get oh, healthy by eating me once a day. Yikes. I heard that. I am glad that this um this fusion grenade has leveled up to the point oh, where it makes the mini fusion I grenades. The God, the I dang, I took a lot of damage there. Okay. I just need a good defensive position. Like this. This is good. What are the little mini fireworks? That, uh, that I can live with. Oh no. I hate those. God dang, y'all firing a lot of those, ain't you? This reminds me of the time I took on an entire army of man-eating space goblins. It was 300 to 1, and those homies still got served. I wish I'd never heard that. Oh, watch the Oh, traps. See, I want to press R2 so bad. And it's about. Okay, so I, it, they they deal a lot of damage. I might be a little low level for this. Whoa, hey! Coordinates acquired for the Iris supercomputer. Oops. I'm gonna try one more time, and then we'll call it. I'm gonna have to do shorter episodes because I don't have as long to record because now I'm working like I'm actually working overtime, like not just full time. I've been getting over 40 hours. Frick. So I'm always at work, asleep for work, or, um, the other thing that's been taking my attention away is those freaking gotcha games. They got me alright. I play Epic 7 and Monster, uh, Monster Super League, and I'm always freaking stuck on them. credit folks can't be easy running around with a 50 pound paperweight on your back unless of course you have my astounding upper body strength 50 pound paperweight is that what he thinks of plank plank is just a paperweight before that's messed up gotcha. let's get a few more targets in here This thing's gonna level up, I hope. That's right, I jump wall holding target at the same time. Freaking playing ball. In just a few here. moments, we'll be raffling off this collectible Q-Force tote bag and travel mug. Purchase your tickets at the concession stand. Uh, it's just annoying how often we're following. That, that, watch it. That's good enough. Launch it. I just gotta keep moving. Oh dang, I thought they were done. Oh no! I wanna beat this one mode and record for like 20 or 30 minutes. And then... That that last one was kind of a waste, but no! Hang on, do we have one of those um those things? The the ones that steal health? No, I don't think we do. Violators will be fined and tortured. Yeah, it's just one guy. Okay, let's try the confuzzler gas. Yes. Let's make them fight each other. Looks like no! Oh, snap. No, I'm so close. Uh, what round was it? Five? No! One more try. One more try. One, one more try. Oh, I know what I need. I just need to run around, collect ammo, and use these wisely. I think, um, so, like, pro tip, if you haven't used you any, oh my gosh. Vitamins. If you haven't used any other weapons, then the Gadgetron vendor crates are always going to have to drop you the weapon you just used. 
Dang, I didn't know there was one behind me too. I don't know if I can actually clear this entire um, round with just the Plasma Stalkers, but I'ma try. Ooh! Dang it. If they drop me a health bar every now and again, that'd be great. I could this use the leech, uh, um, the leech gas, but I don't have it right the now. Arena. Violators will be fined and tortured. I'm surprised they can even say the word torture. You can't say that nowadays in these woke games. Oh my gosh, that was supposed to be dash forward. And all I did was a weak little jump. I bet you can clear this whole thing with just this strategy right here. This reminds me of the time I took on an entire army of man-eating space goblins. It was 300 to 1, and those homies still got served. Where's the last one? There it is. Oh, that's messed up. Well, I did run right in front of them. They, they got the free hit on that one. Drop a few more of these guys. Whoa! No, no, no. That one's gonna get me. Ooh. Okay, we're around five. Don't hold back now. No! What? That's cheating. Bruh! You're not letting me lock on. Oh my god. What the? Whoa, I hope our challenger filled out those organ donor cards. Whoa, a lucky shot from Mustachio. Let's see what he does next. Jesus Christ, really? Weapons are just too weak right now. Folks, this one's called the lightning round. I'm going to give it a couple of tries since that flaming, uh, flaming Kragmite thing is ridiculous. Uh, I can't even get most of these, unfortunately. I'm going to do a lot of them possibly off uh, camera because this game is just different from all the other ones. But I'm going to at least give it a try. And why would I try to do it? Lightning round. Let's see how our challenger does with only one weapon. Oh, right. Shock Rabbit. Now, I don't know if this is one of those ones where I have to make them hit Whoa, each other. Lucky shot from Mustachio. Let's see what he does next. I also don't have a very upgraded shock ravager. It's only V2, but this will be good for upgrading it. Let's group them all together. No, no, our challenger cowardly flees his opponents. His tail between his legs, his eyes filled with tears. I taught him that trick. That's me. Ah, oh, dang it. They're not close enough together. But they're using their attacks so quickly that it's hard to get them. I'm basically just worried I'm going to run out of ammo, but it does look like they give you some ammo. Okay, so that's not... It's not the challenge. That's not the challenge. Because um, in Deadlock, there's a mode where all you have is the plasma whip, which is what they used to call it. Uh, 
but you basically can't complete it unless the plasma whip is fully upgraded or you make the enemies hit each other. Because if you don't do that, you will eventually run out of ammo before you can defeat all the enemies. Which is what I thought this was doing here, but apparently not. I think they use those attacks too, too quickly. Like, don't you think they're firing a little too fast? I don't know, maybe I'm gonna get stronger later on. Three of three. There we go. Oh, okay, I think we got this one. Nice. Good. Okay. At least I can end this episode off with a challenge complete. I'm gonna make slightly shorter episodes so that there can actually be more on the channel each week. And it doesn't go like a week without recording. But, um,. In a few hours here, as the sun continues to rise and screw up my green screen, I'm going to go to the living room and start playing some Call of Duty. Hopefully with Mike the Shooter Endgame. So, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. Uh, I will see you in the next one. Before we head off, uh, let's see. I don't want to trigger another cutscene, so I'm just going to exit out. Uh, but thank you all so much for watching. That's all the time I have left for this one. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, let me know in the comment section below. Likes are always appreciated, and until next time, take it easy.